today let us see an example in the topic hamiltonian graphs uh, this is the example every complete graph on n vertices is hamiltonian that is what we are asked to prove and similarly particularly we are asked when n is equal to 7 k7 is a hamiltonian graph find all h disjoint hamilton uh, circuits in k7 this is asked so what is a complete graph every vertex is adjacent with every other vertex in the graph that is called a complete graph what is a hamilton circuit circuit passing through all vertices exactly once is a hamilton circuit if the graph has hamilton circuit it is called a hamiltonian graph now let us consider complete graph on n, n vertices and take the vertices as v1 v2 etc vn start with the vertex v1 so complete graph so v1 is adjacent with all other vertices in particular v2 so there is an edge v1 v2 now after visiting v2 go to v3 since it's a complete graph there is an edge connecting v2 and v3 so pass through the edge v2 v3 so v3 is visited and likewise you proceed on visiting each and every vertex in this order and once vertex vi is vis visited VI is adjacent with every other vertices in particular it is adjacent with VI plus 1 so pass through the edge VI VI plus 1 and if we proceed in this way we will end at VN and VN is adjacent with V1 so we will end uh, close the circuit with V1 so this is the Hamilton uh, it is the circuit passing through all the vertices of the graph so it's a, exactly once it's a Hamilton graph so KN is Hamiltonian. <coughs> K7 is also Hamiltonian. We can prove in this way. V1, V1 is passed to V2, V2 is passed to V3, V3 is passed to V4, V4 is passed to V5, V5 to V6, V6 to V7 and V7 to V1. This is the Hamilton, one of the Hamilton circuit in K7. Now, we are asked to find out all the edges in K7. So, K7 has 21 edges. I have written all the edges of K7. V1 to V2, V1 to V3, V1 to V4, V1 to V5, V1 to V6, V1 to V7. Similarly, V2 to V3, V2 to V4, V2 to V5, V2 to V6, V2 to V7. Likewise, I write uh, all the 21 edges of the graph K7, complete graph on 7 vertices. Now, encircle the first Hamilton circuit, V1 to V2 v2 then v3 v3 to v4 v4 to v5 v5 to v6 v6 to v7 v7 to v1 that gives the first hamilton circuit now it is encircled in the color red now let uh, let me give another hamilton circuit uh, the edges are encircled in blue v1 to v3 so it's ending at v3 again take a uh, edge V3 to V5. It is ending at V5. Again, take an edge V5 to V7. It is ending at V7. Again, take an edge V7 to V2. Then take an edge V2 to V4. Take an edge V4 to V6. Take an edge V6 to V1. And thus, all the vert uh, vertices are passed through exactly once we got a Hamilton circuit. Then for another Hamilton circuit that are encircled in green, V1 to V4, then V4 to V7, then V7 to V3, then V3 to V6, then V6 to V2, then V2 to V5, and finally V5 to V1. This is the Hamilton circuit. So there are three edge disjoint uh, Hamilton circuits in K7 and I can give one more information the degree of each vertex in K7 each vertex in K7 is 6 that is E1 so K7 is Eulerian also if the vertices all the vertices of a graph is E1 it is an Eulerian graph we have seen in a theorem and if you use that theorem, K7 is Eulerian also. So with this, this problem is over.
and let us see another problem in uh, in the next video thank you